Illegal immigrants in California are one step closer to getting health insurance tonight. Correspondent William Lajeunesse is in Los Angeles with details on a bill that would allow undocumented immigrants access to health care on the taxpayer's dime. Health for all! Health for all! In a national first, a bill in California would enroll all illegal immigrants under 19 and thousands of adults into California's version of Medicaid, the national health care program for the poor. The bill would cost taxpayers about $500 million to cover 240,000 undocumented workers and their families. We need support from everyone because we're all healthier when everyone is covered. Illegal immigrants are currently entitled only to emergency care and cancer treatment, and in 15 states, a Abortion services. Under the new bill in Sacramento, enrollees would be entitled to any and all medical services paid for by state taxpayers if federal money was not available. I think this is going to be a hot button issue. You know, the, uh, the president and Congress, when they passed the Affordable Care Act, set out some pretty clear guidelines for who is going to be eligible for coverage. If it seems that those guidelines are being altered uh, at the discretion of uh, the Obama administration, I think that's going to be a problem. Unlike Medicaid recipients, illegal immigrants are barred from Obamacare subsidies. California will ask for a waiver to at least allow qualified immigrants to buy coverage through the state exchange. <laughs> Supporters argue managed care is cheaper than emergency care, so the state should enroll as many as it can afford. If you're expecting a free lunch here, the costs are actually going to go down. I'd say no, costs are probably going to go up. Now, only two Republicans voted for this bill, which now goes to the democratically controlled state assembly before Governor Jerry Brown, who supports it in principle, depending on the cost. Analysts say New York and Illinois could follow. Right.